What's going on, YouTube? It's your boy, Silverback June. I'm out here with Drag Trip Rabies 2.0. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, today's episode, today we're going to be vlogging about the BBK throttle body for the um for the charges. Well, BBK makes throttle bodies for for any brand, whatever, any any manufacturer, any car, whatever, but I'm installing it on my car today. You know what I'm saying? Supposedly it's going to give me like 10 to 24 horsepower. I don't know, we'll see, but that's what it says, but check it out, man. Hoo you know what I'm saying? So this is the BBK throttle body right here. We're going to change the, we're going to take the stock throttle body out. We're going to put the BBK one in. This is an 80, this is an 85 millimeter throttle body made by BBK. Um, when you install this thing, you do have to follow the instructions. You know, when you install it, it's not just, it, it's, it's a very simple mod. It's very quick, easy to do, but you have to follow the instructions that come with the BBK throttle body. You can't just throw the throttle body in there and expect, you know, and expect for it to work. You know what I'm saying? Your check engine light will come on, your lightning bulb will come on, everything will come on, and your car will run like shit. So anyway, we about to install this today. I'm gonna show you how to do it, and I'm gonna show you what tools you need to get it done, all right? And we're gonna have, to also, we're gonna have to do the throttle body relearn procedure. I'm gonna show you how to do that too. All right, man, Silverback June, Drive Trip Gravy 2.0. We out. I'm going to stay tuned. I'm going to show you what tools you need, and we're going to get back to it. All right, peace. All right, man. So, anyway, here's the tools you're going to need. Of course, you're going to need the throttle body, okay? You're going to need a 10-millimeter quarter-inch socket with a quarter-inch ratchet, an 8-millimeter socket, Maybe a little extension, all right? And a screwdriver, all right? That's all, those are all the tools you need to take the throttle body out, and that's it. And you're gonna have to take your intake out, of course, but like I said, all you need is a screwdriver for that. But the first thing you wanna do, is from what I heard in the procedure, all right? Is you gotta go back to your battery, okay? Your battery's in the trunk right here. And you want to disconnect your negative battery terminal, okay? You want to loosen it, take it off before you start working on the throttle body, okay? So you want to disconnect that. That's out the way, all right? You're going to disconnect that. Now you could go in front and you could do what you got to do, all right? So the first thing we're going to do now that we got everything disconnected, we are going to take this intake off. We're gonna disconnect the sensor first. Let's disconnect the sensor, the air temp sensor. Disconnect the throttle body sensor, all right? Let's take that off, all right? Push that to the side, all right? Good. Now we're gonna take our flathead screwdriver and loosen the, uh, unbolt the, the intake. All right. I'm gonna do that. Let's put our throttle body over here. Hold on one sec. All right. Over here. Right, we got this loose. We got this loose. We got this loose. Now we gonna take this off. All right, and take this out. And take pretty much out. All right. Got the intake down on the ground. Boom. Right. Sold out. Well, what's good, Goonie? Goonie work. Got the camera up there. Stop recording. Go for it. Stop recording. All right. So now let's take the let's, let's start focusing on the 
focus on this throttle body right here all right that is an eight millimeter right that's an eight millimeter socket okay eight millimeter right here take your eight millimeter socket loosen it loosen the bolts all right boom one right here one down here there's another one right here hidden underneath here all right that's all you gotta do just you know nice and easy this one you can't get to it if you can't get to this one you can shorten it all right take your ratchet shorten it right here Go right here like this. Alright. I don't know. Oh, I think that was the clamp for the for the intake for the throttle bar. Alright. So nice and easy. We're gonna reuse these bolts, okay? So we're gonna reuse these bolts for the throttle body. For the new throttle body. Alright. All right, take this hole. Oh. Nice and easy. You could use an uh, air ratchet, but I prefer not to. You know, like I said, it's real easy to do by hand. You know what I'm saying? You are a mechanic. Excuse me? You are a mechanic. Yeah, I'm a mechanic. You, have, you know everything. I know enough. I know a lot. Right now, I have a lamb here. GoPro, stop recording. Oh, so, as you can see, we got the old throttle body out right here. All right, we got the old throttle body. All right. This is the new one. We got the BBK joint right here. BBK. It's a 85 millimeter. Supposedly, this is supposed to give you, I don't know, supposed to give you like 10 to 20, 10 to 20 horsepower, supposedly. That's what they say. Obviously, you could tell the bores are bigger on the 85. You got 85, you put them together, close together. It's a little bit different. It's a little bit bigger than the original. All right, so you're gonna be using the same bolts. You're gonna be reusing the same bolts for the throttle body. You know, there's no, this is real simple. But what we're gonna do right here, we're gonna wipe this down, clean this up a little bit. All right, you gotta clean this up, this gasket. You're gonna reuse this gasket, but we're gonna clean this up. All right, I'll get back to you. All right, so we're gonna about to install the new throttle body. You know, you start off with one or two, you know, you reusing the old gasket, right? And I line it up. I right, got one right here. All right. You can take, you can even take your extension take your extension right here put one on the bottom another one on the bottom right here like I said you're gonna reuse your old bolts okay you don't want to strip it you just want to you know nice and easy you know stuff in there all right all right I'm gonna start start tightening the bolts start tightening the bolts down all right 
nice and easy. All right. I'm gonna tighten everything up yet. I'm just gonna go nice and slow. Right. And do it in sequence, you know what I mean? Do it a little like night, night in sequence. Like I go from up top, then I go to the bottom down here. You know what I mean? Nice and slow. Alright. Like to make it like to make it even. Then I'll go up top here. You know, and just bring it in nice and slow. Alright. Nice and easy. Real smooth mod, real, real, you know, not long to do. But you gotta take your time. You know what I'm saying? Take your time. Take your time. Go right here, do this one. <laughs> I hear you. Here, yeah, all right. Nice and easy. All right. That's snug. Then you go up here. Snug that one down. Gotta go up top right here. Snug it down. You want to make sure the throttle body is seated properly, okay? Because you don't want air to come out. You don't want air to come out of your throttle body. All right. Like that. All right. Just enough, like this. Boom. One. Just double check it. Two, double check everything. All your boats, double check. All right, boom. This last one right here. Boom. All right. Good. All right, now your throttle body is in. We gonna put everything back together, your intake and all that. And then I'm gonna show you the throttle body we learned. All right, Silverback June. Peace. All right, we go. We going back to the battery. So now we gonna plug the battery back up again. All right, I'll put the battery back. I think we had the, the battery off more than five minutes. They say a five minutes, you gotta have the battery off for five minutes to do the relearn procedure. All right, do the relearn. So we gonna plug this battery back. All right, make sure, nice and tight. All right, we got everything, we got everything plugged up. All right, the throttle body's back on. Always keep your old throttle body, never throw your old throttle body out. You never know, you never know what you're gonna, what you're gonna need it for. But anyway, the temp sensor's back on. The new throttle body's on. Your intake is back on. We're not gonna start the car, all right? We are not gonna start the car. We're gonna do this relearn procedure. All right now, what you gonna do? It's hot. Like I said, if you don't know what to do, the instructions is right here, BBK. Right, so here's the procedure right here of the throttle body we learned. BBK does give you, uh, uh, they do give you uh, uh, instructions on how to do it, all right? So basically, we on step two. So we're going to turn the ignition key on position. All right. 
We're not going to start it. All right. And then slowly we're going to depress the gas pedal. The gas pedal on the bottom. Three times. So Monkey. one slowly, right? Let it up. Two. Let it up. Three. Let it up slow. Now right here. I'm gonna hold it until we see the check engine light blinking. If it doesn't blink, then the procedure wasn't done properly. Okay. All right, so I got my timer set for five minutes. They told me I had to um, basically. You thought this, this one sound different now? You put it on? I don't even know. I hope. Got my man Biggs out here. You know what I'm saying? Biggs is supporting the channel. You know what I'm saying? Go follow Biggs too, man. Biggs got his own YouTube channel, channel too. What's your channel name, man? It's called uh, Biggs. It's called, it's called Big Trucks. Big Trucks? All right, all right. Yeah, man. Big Trucks. Go support my man Biggs, man. Oh, he got two videos so far, so you know what I'm saying? About to put him onto the YouTube world, you know what I'm saying? Get some algorithm going. You know what I mean? That's what it's about. But yeah, man, I got my timer on set for five minutes. Right now, I got to wait five minutes. I disconnected the battery. I had to disconnect the battery for another five minutes. To do the throttle body relearn, all right? Cause supposedly something didn't work, whatever. So I had to disconnect it for five minutes. Remember what you did, nigga. Switch your whole operations up. Left them over here and came over here. I always like to yeah. slide over here a little better, cause like it's gonna change. Yeah, I like that. I like that. I mean, I still got my my, my stuff over there. Back over there. Yeah, nah, yeah I would. Head. I would. I would. So yeah. Okay, I got we in the car again. I got my computer just in case I got codes and stuff like that. But um, we're going to try to do this throttle body relearn again. So basically, put the key to the on position. And push the accelerator pedal three times. One. Two. I already see the check engine light start flashing already. Three. Hold it. Now you shut it off. Right? You shut it off. And then I believe you can start the car now. You shut it off. This check engine light start flashing. Get my 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 thing together. The procedure. All right. Like I said, I got it already dialed into my phone. Uh, pedal flow until the engine crashes. Release the pedal and turn off the engine. Now I'm gonna start. Now, now I can start my car. That's how you do the throttle body relearn procedure. Um, as you can see, I ain't got no check engine light, no nothing. You know what I'm saying? You depress the pedal three times, but real slow. One, two, hold it down, slow. Bring it down and up, real slow. Down and up, real slow. When you get to the third part, when you get to the third, you go down it's real slow and come back up slow, shut the car off. You know what I'm saying? And then start it. Right now, I'm at idle. You know what I'm saying? Right now, I'm at decent idle right now. Like, all jokes aside. And right now, I'm just going to let the car run for a little while. Let the, let the throttle body 
let the throttle body adjust, all right? Let the throttle body calibrate itself. You know what I mean? So that's what you want to do when you're doing this throttle body upgrade. All right? Always keep your old throttle body because you never know. Like I said, man. The chairman, Silverback June. I'm out. Me and my man, Biggs, is out here. I'm out here, Silverback Jewel, BBK throttle body upgrade. You know what I'm saying? This is, it's, it's kinda on the expensive side, so you might wanna take your time and um and buy it, but you know what I'm saying? If I could get, if I could get 10, 24 horsepower out of it, hey, it is what it is, you know what I'm saying? But yeah, I'ma take this for a spin. I'ma take this for a spin, and I'ma come back, and I'ma see what it is. All right, man, Silverback June. If you like this content, like, share, subscribe to my channel. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, man. Like, share, subscribe. It's important that you like, share, subscribe to my channel, man. Silverback June. I'm going to go take this joint for a spin. You know what I'm saying? You see the light spinning? Silverback June, man. I'm out. Peace.